Hey guys, welcome back to the Pink Envelope. I am so excited. My wantable Cozy Tober is here. So I just finished filming my wantable denim style edit. So, so good. Bounce straight to this one. I'm not sure which order I'm gonna release them in, but I'll pop uh, the denim edit up here. These are two that I highly recommend you do. Sometimes with the denim edit, I order multiple, same with Cozy Tober. Sometimes I order multiple. So I will order Cozy Tober Active, then I'll order Cozy Tober Style, and then I order Cozy Tober Sleep. So they, the Cozy Tober comes in all three style edits. Denim just comes in, <laughs> it just comes in style. Just like imagining like little jort underwear. Don't think that's what we're going for. Um, I This is my second time to get to unbox this one. I unboxed it last year, you can go check it out up here. Huge win, huge, huge win. So let me pull this here because just looking at the top of this, you can see all the amazing textures. Oh, there's the free gift right there. It's a big box, really, really full of stuff. So this is not one of the normal monthly edits that you receive. This is one of their exclusive pop-up themed edits. So if you have a subscription with them, you can add on these at any time. So I usually do my monthly or my regular edits every other month. So if I have a regular edit every other month, the month in between, I can add on a themed edit or two. These themed edits do work the same as the regular style edits. So it's a $20 style fee. If you keep more than five of these seven items they send you, you get 20% off. You can have regular edits sent as frequently as you want and you can order themed edits as frequently or infrequently as you want. If you go down below and use my URL and it's your first time to shop at Wantable, you're gonna get somewhere between 20 and $35 to shop with. They told me it was a $20 coupon code that I could give you guys, but you guys have been reporting back that it's actually giving you $35 off. So maybe if you'd give it a try, comment below and let us know what you got. In the themed edits, on occasion, they include gifts. Let me tell you about the gifts. They're good. I've never, ever received a crappy gift. I got a bracelet that goes into a bracelet stack I have. Uh, this is today's gift. I've gotten a Yeti wantable cup that we use all the time. I got a like trucker hat that my daughter and my husband both have stolen and they rotate wearing. And there's no like extra fee or anything. It is truly a free gift. So for the Cozy Tober style edit, I got this cream Sherpa waist bag or fanny pack depending on how old you are. Super cute, the zipper on it is great. It has two little pockets inside. It screams winter cozy. Uh, the buckle on it is extremely nice. It's still got the plastic wrap on it, but can y'all see? It's like super, super fancy. Oh, there's a pocket on the back as well. So let me just try it on real quick. I, oh, let me loosen it. Oh, it's easy to loosen. Oh, that was really nice. Okay. There we go. Oh my gosh. Y'all, that is so cute. We just got back from our big trip to Big Bend and I wore fanny packs the entire time. I never even took a bag. I wish I would have had this one. This would have been super cute. You also get a bag like this. Anything that you don't like, you put it in here. When you go to checkout, it'll ask you, do you want us to come pick it up? Just click yes, it's free. You can set this bag right out on your front porch and your USPS man or whoever you use We'll swing by and pick it up. Easy breezy. Okay. Ooh, I have a cell item in my box. That's kind of cool. Okay, so last time I held up my invoice, my camera couldn't focus because the box was on the counter. So we're gonna try this again and see if it works. Here is my invoice of all the things that are in my box. You can see whether I've requested them or not, their price point, just information about them. I think in my last three edits, I've received a sell item, which is kind of cool. I'm gonna show you all of these really quickly right here, and then uh, I'll show it on my body as well, just so you can get a good idea on fit. I love the colors on this. Such an easy little sweater. The long sleeve textured crew neck sweater by Tribal, $88. This is one of the items that I requested that they send me. I am all things sweater right now. I'm wearing a sweater now, and it's 77 outside. We have had cool weather, or it's been in like the 50s and 60s, 
but it's going to warm up for the next couple of days and then it drops back down and it looks like it's going to stick here for good. So I feel like the timing on this is great. I want to get all of my clothes in so that I am ready when the cold weather sticks. And so between that denim edit and this edit, I went into my room, pulled out all the winter storage bins that have all of my winter clothes and started organizing. I needed to get a good idea for what I already had what I needed to sell, what I needed to donate, and what I want to order for this season. So my room is a huge mess right now, but I'm prepping like my fall winter closet and it's been super fun. What is this? Feels like a scarf. Ooh. It's a top. Oh, I, holding it up, don't know how I feel. Bishop and Young, okay, good brand. The Selena Poet Blouse, size small in Wisteria. Oh, I think I'll probably like it. I'm gonna have to try it on to get the full feel because it has that collar, it has a real loose sleeve, it is see-through, which is very Texas fall appropriate. I've been incorporating more blacks in my wardrobe recently. I'm not sure why, I've just been about it. So the timing on that part is excellent. Look how cute this is together, these two. Love, love. Okay, we're gonna give it a try. Denim, I love denim. I love denim and I ordered the denim edit and it was so good. Y'all, I was super disciplined. If I have not already linked it, I wanna make sure I link it up here. You have to see it. Also, you know how we always talk about my denim? I'm like, I have like 50 pairs of denim. We literally drug it all out and counted exactly how many denim I have in my spring summer lineup because I hadn't got the bin out yet. We didn't add an account for fall winter. So I haven't even looked at it yet, but I know there's at least another 15 in that fall winter bin. Go watch that other video and that'll tell you the total of how many pairs of denim I own. That being said, I'm not thinking about that right now because this is my all time favorite brand. This is Hidden Denim. Hidden Denim is wonderful because it's an under $100 price point, but the denim screams luxury. It washes well, it has a great stretch that presents like luxury denim. I love Hidden. So these, oh, they look casual and chill and fun. I typically would call this a summer denim. Light in color, light in texture, but I might be willing to, you know, splurge. Oh, that's the item that's on sale. The denim's on sale. There's no way. I mean, these are going to have to fit me atrociously for me not to keep them. The Hidden Tracy Straight Leg in medium light color, size 25, $66. Ooh, I'm loving these creams. Is this like a little puffer vest? <gasps> I need a new vest so bad. I just got rid of mine because it was really, really dated and I put it on. I was like, mm, this needs to go. The Z Supply Warm Up Vest in Sandstone, $99. Ooh, well that's a little bit more than I thought this would have been marked at. It's not like a true puffer vest, it's actually very light, which is really perfect for where I live in Texas. But ooh, the price at $100 seems a little high. However, if I can get my buy five discount in play, I'll be good. When you're shopping, always be thinking about your buy five discount when it comes to Wantable. Uh, once again, referencing the denim edit, go to the end of that video. I have a uh, minute markers. So, like there's minute markers on this video below so you can jump all around. Same thing with that denim edit. All my videos have it. Uh, you can, if you don't want to watch the whole thing, jump down to the end where I'm running numbers versus what I kept and what I didn't keep. Uh, and you can see that I kept a pair of pants that I hated that didn't even fit me. And you can see why. Go check it out. Um, this green is radiating out of the box which means it's gonna radiate when it's on my body. And that makes me very happy. I love color with some color and a little bit more color. Ooh, I mean, <laughs> this looks like a Teletubby top. What the heck? I'm guessing <laughs> it's supposed to be a big chunky collar that lays down like this. That is hilarious. It is super soft. The Molly Bracken Knit quarter zip pullover in emerald green, size small, retail value $79. Oh my gosh. So these pants and this shirt is like my go-to wardrobe. 
If it's really cold, I wear a boot. If it's not, I wear flip flops. And that's like Texas winter. Oh, more pants. We always like more pants. I don't even have a pair of pants like this. But these are Dear John. And historically, Dear John denim hate me. They don't work. I don't know why. I think it's because I don't have hips or a booty. And I feel like you have to have hips and a booty to wear Dear John. However, love the rough cut bottom, love the flare, love everything about these pretty much. So we're gonna give them a try. The color is awesome. The Fiona Wide Leg in Cinnamon, $105. So from the girl who needs no pants, they're gonna have to fit pretty great to keep them at over $100 because uh, my, my, my hidden jeans always hook me up. Ooh. This has very Aztec inspired print on it. What is it? Oh, it's a layering piece. It's a cardigan. I don't typically wear cardigans. Is that weird? I don't like them. However, normally I go through when I'm doing my stream and I just immediately cross out all cardigans and say, don't send them. And this year I made myself not do it. Well, now I'm thankful because I love Aztec printed things. And look at this guy. It has a great Aztec print to it. Okay. Well, I'm also noticing we've got some good outfits. Like these pants and this top together, super cute. Any of the tops with these pants, super cute. Let's do a little, little runway show real quick so you can see these items on. Okay, I want to hear from you guys what you think about these outfits because I am eating my words just a little bit. Um, the, the Dear John, like rust colored pants, I love them. However, these are good, but they're not great. I literally have two, three, maybe even four other pair that fit like very similar. So the only reason I would keep these pants would be to like seal the deal on the buy five discount because I like the other ones better and I'm trying to balance the budget. Love the Aztec cardigan. Should I keep it? This feels so outside of my norm and I'm kind of loving it. It's very easy. I have on a tank top here that I got in a wantable from this summer, but you saw me earlier with the really thick long sleeve top. It worked with both. And then the green shirt, hilarious. I honestly, 
Don't know how I feel about it. I love the green. I can't tell if the collar plus my big old poofy hair is too much. I think somebody with a very sleek short bob would own that sweater or at least straight hair you could pin up, but I'm open to feedback. And then we have the very first sweater I put on. Did it wash me out? You gotta tell me. Did I look washed out or did it look cute? Um, I just feel like we have good options. Oh, and the vest. I don't know how I feel about the vest. I think it's a size too big. I like my vest to fit a little snugger and I feel like that one was loose. So I'm not gonna make any decisions till A, I can show my husband because he didn't see and he always likes to vote on my clothes. B, y'all lean in and tell me. I feel like I always choose my best clothes when I trust him and trust y'all. So that's the path I'm taking. I will be running through here though and I'll get my buy five. There's enough items in here that I like and love that I, I, you have to, you just have to get the buy five discount. It really is a huge discount when they knock 20% off the top. Then anything else I don't like, I will put in this bag online on my computer. I will schedule a pickup that morning. I'll put the bag out and I am done. Um, if you wanna see more from Wantable, maybe you're new and just not quite sure, head up here, I have a playlist full of Wantable. I have washed their clothes, worn their clothes. They are good, durable clothes. Sure, a few things have funny washing instructions. I wouldn't be surprised if this one does. Let's see. Hand wash, do not wring, reshape, lay flat. So I would do delicate cycle in my wash and put lay flat to dry, no big deal. Although, really wouldn't be washing this all that much. But things like their denim and their regular shirts, like this shirt here, I wash and wear all the time. They do last, they are great. I had a customer service issue one time with a shirt that I don't remember, it fell apart or got the fuzzies all on it and called them and they fixed it that quick. It was a great experience. So I can vouch for durability when it comes to Wantables clothes. I'd also like to take a moment and give a shout out to my daughters, my niece and their friends. They decorated this background in full for Halloween. Um, I have to say, I think they did a pretty good job. I am a more is more person, and this is a bit overwhelming for me. <laughs> but I honestly don't have the heart to take it down because anybody who comes in this house, they're the first ones to be like, oh, uh, just so you know, my mom didn't decorate that, we did. And so I'm like, I, we have to leave it. They spent a lot of time in the Pink Envelope Playhouse pulling out our Halloween bin and decorating this with all sorts of wonderfuls. If you have not already subscribed to the channel, if you wanna chat but you don't feel comfortable chatting in a group of 25,000 here on YouTube, head over to the Pink Envelope private Facebook group. That is where we hang out and we talk about all sorts of things and ask questions. You can request boxes to be open, everything. So that is down below in the description. Um, of course, subscribe. We are kicking off winter and all things wonderful and you don't wanna miss it because we're gonna be banging out some great coupon codes. We're gonna be finding the best of advent calendars and then of course, all of our winter Christmas holiday will be replacing what you see here very, very soon. I hope that you are having an absolutely amazing day. And if you did subscribe to the channel, I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye y'all.